Samos, an island in the eastern Aegean, home to the last remaining population of common chameleons in Greece. Prehensile tail, independently moving eyes and a projectile tongue make this distinct lizard recognizable in the wild. But her uncanny ability to blend into the nature around her makes her exceedingly difficult to spot. As the chameleon moves, she uses her bird-like feet to grasp onto branches, rocking back and forth ever so slightly to mimic a leaf blowing in the wind. The chameleon also has the unique capacity to change colour. Despite the common belief that their evolutionary function is to camouflage from predators, the changes actually reflect her mood. Normally a light shade of green, when angry, frustrated or scared, she will turn a speckled black. Despite its name, the common chameleon has become increasingly rare in the eastern Mediterranean region. Though once found on other Greek islands, including Chios and Crete, there have been no reported sightings on these islands in over two decades. Isolated populations have a higher likelihood of extinction. The chameleon's limited population range in this region of the world therefore complicates conservation efforts on Samos, and her future is uncertain. Archipelagos, a Greek environmental conservation organization with a research base on southern Samos, has been working to implement local population surveys. Researchers monitor the population fluctuations throughout the year based on data collected on nighttime outings. Armed with torches and calipers, they search the trees to spot and measure chameleons to gather as much information as possible about their seasonal growth and presence. Zero, so it's one, one point one. Take off a zero. So that is that's actually measuring one point two right there, so one point three. Puffed up, so you might want to take off a couple centimeters because it's pissed at you. The current survey project represents a renewed effort to understand how to minimize man's negative impact on chameleon habitats, and may be crucial to the survival of the species. One of the principal difficulties in efforts to conserve chameleon habitats is the fact that chameleons prefer to reside in cultivated areas, putting them on a collision course with harmful anthropogenic activity. Pesticides, vehicles and household pets all pose threats to chameleons living in close proximity to humans. In addition, destructive agricultural practices can also put chameleons at risk if their life cycles are not taken into account. Drainage ditch clearing, a common practice among Samian farmers, can be particularly harmful after chameleons have laid their eggs. 
Since chameleons lay their eggs deep underground, this process of churning and levelling the soil can destroy eggs and, along with them, any future prospect of a chameleon comeback. Despite her protected status, the common chameleon also faces the serious threat of illegal capture. Their unique features have made them attractive as pets, and the collection and trade of these creatures on the black market persists, seemingly unregulated. But there is hope. The people of Samos recognize the importance of protecting their reptilian neighbor, a species at the heart of the island's biodiversity and a source of Samian pride. While environmental research can shed light on how to minimize human impact on the chameleon's lifestyle, only local initiative can put an end to illegal capture and trade and ensure the future of the common chameleon on Samos.